Hey, good morning. We officially have it. two cars in the parking lot besides my car, which is exciting. We're about an hour away from students actually being able to show up for school here. Uh, Scott Maben with the uh, Coeur d'Alene Public School District said that they should be showing up anywhere between 7 and 7.30 to start this first day of school off. So very exciting, of course. But Maben also told me that the community is really excited to just have more of a normal first day of back to school. People are excited. They, they are excited that school is starting on time this year and that we're all in, in our buildings full time. Um, I do hear that from our, uh, our teachers and our other staff and from a lot of families and students. At the same time, we, I, I don't want to overlook the trepidation that people have about um, what's going on with the pandemic and the spike in this Delta variant. Now, Maven says they are paying attention to what's happening in the local hospitals, especially with children. And as school gets going, there is concern in the community about COVID-19 outbreaks in classrooms. The district says they are ready to go back to online learning if they absolutely need to. As of now, though, they are not requiring masks. The district also will not be providing official testing for students who have been exposed to COVID-19, but they will have take home self tests available at their schools. Plus, there will be resources for families as to where they can find other COVID-19 tests in the community. Mabin says their nursing staff will help determine if and when a student needs to quarantine away from school. And there, of course, has been a lot of debate that we've been covering here on Crem2 about how the Coeur d'Alene Public School District is handling these COVID-19 protocols. But really, Mabin says that they're hearing both sides of the debates here and it's up to a vote from the board to decide what happens as the school year continues. Live in Coeur d'Alene, I'm Nicole Hernandez.